Hello everyone, my name is Zambra. Thank you guys so much for clicking on this video and deciding to watch me. Today we are back with more My Hero Academia. We are watching the final episode of season five, the high deep blue sky, which judging from the picture, it looks like we're going back to the UA students, which is awesome. I miss them. The villain arc was kind of dark, a lot of death. So it'd be nice to go to some lighter side of things. So I am hyped. Hope you guys are as well. Please keep in mind to go support the official release of My Hero Academia over on Funimation. It's the best place to watch the dub. And of course, if you like my content and want to support me, check out my Patreon page. Link down in the description below to get access to the full timer reactions over there. But without further ado, let's get started. One month of this moment, the Liberation oh. Army recognizes okay. <laughs> demolition of the like, commander. We gotta stop time jumping. You too late. No wonder you let me come in. Oh gosh. What happened to Dega? It was you guys, right? If only someone had been strong enough to stop the league sooner, those poor citizens might not have died. I'm not sure that this is actually him, but you did kill somebody. How heroic. So long since we saw that scene that I was like, probably not, but no! Oh no! No, but Bakugo! You have become the embodiment of destruction. So I must ask, why do you still seek more power? If more strength is available, why wouldn't I take it? It's true that I'm no longer forced to use cheap tricks, but look, my arm is ravaged. Yeah. This is from using my ability once. That's interesting. It's kind of similar to Deku. No one took my research seriously. Except all for one, of course. Uh-huh. If our bodies can't harness memory and power, humanity will become unstable. Oh! Signs of this began showing up as early as the fourth quarter generation. All for one recognized that the problem with capacity was a serious one which needed to be remedied. For the next four months, your life will be one of hellish agony. Four months? When you months? come out on the other side, if you survive, the world will be in the palm of your hand. Oh. Even one for all. One for all. Of the many designs your master had for this world, that power was the only one that didn't end up going to plan. Oh. Burn. Is it going to go back to my hero, or is it going to be villain still? Hey, my hero! Let's go! We're back! <laughs> hey, brother, listen! <laughs> the present! Oh. It feels like that was so long ago. Yeah, right? It, ha it has been a bit. Don't for us. Back for approval anymore, do you? Keep going, young man. Oh, that's so cute. I love it. That's adorable. Hey, Bakugo. Are you good with fighting when it's cold out now? I used to dead shots. Winter's crap. Well, it's going to your hotter, cooler, and faster. I don't know. I'm still not able to catch up to any death with that. Ha. You proud of yourself? In general, yes. I was able to gain control of Black Whip. Thank you! <laughs> Hopefully, that's ancient history, okay? Plus, look, seeing you inspired me to have these wires put in my costume. <laughs> You're nothing compared to something like Sarah and his team. Still, I made that experience something useful. And I think both of us are better because of it. Aww, y'all are great. Aww, <laughs> <laughs> babies! Given the work studies, the safety commission must know something. Yeah. yeah. If we find out who's manufacturing no more, present, Mike. then what? We'll have a surprise karaoke contest with them, then boil their guts while their eardrums bleed. And you? Well... Destroy Sawa! 
Sorry to bother you during your break. Muriel? Eraser. It's about Ari. <gasps> what? What? What about Ari? <gasps> oh, honey. It's my horn. What's an itch? Don't worry. You're in excellent hands at UA. Oh, honey. Oh my god, I got so scared. I was like, what's wrong with her? <laughs> Stressed. I'm sorry. I couldn't figure everything out. Oh, the next okay. step is yours. Okay, so now we know most of their quirks at least. Who cares about a bunch of dead old heroes? I'm tired of wasting my time waiting for you guys to figure stuff out. Shut the fuck up. Nobody wants to hear it. Nobody will ever want to hear it. Nobody cares. None of these people started with quirks that were even worth mentioning. So it's no wonder I haven't heard of these nobodies. Huh? What are you talking about? Their powers are amazing! Yeah, because from the perspective of a loser like you, any quirk is amazing! That's me. You know how to hit me where it hurts. Yeah, but he's not really raw. <laughs> All for one crushed anybody who could be considered strong. That was made possible by his perseverance and wide-ranging influence. As they died, struggling in terrible pain, the past users entrusted this power to the future, adding to its legacy. They weren't hmm. chosen ones. They were just the people who received the power the people who passed it on the fight that kept repeating itself. Wow. Like, I know this. It's just kind of crazy to hear it. No wonder they all died young. <gasps> oh! Yes. True. So, what quirk are you going to make oh. the damn nerd learn to use next? The next power you should manifest is float. Oh. <gasps> My master's ability. Hi, baby! I love you! A new ability? and catch back up to you. You'll probably be in the out of control you. and die. No, I got the hang of Blackwood quickly, so I should be able die. to- Die! Listen to these friendos. Oh my gosh. They're really getting along in their own special way. Deku's kind of talking back. Better hurry up and lend a hand. Otherwise, it's no meat for you. Uh, Wait, I'm on it. Really? You think you can take me away from me, Sparky? Oh, um, my- What fool cut the chives? I did. You shamed your sister! You shamed your sister. <laughs> Damn. I can't believe I'm so lucky. To pass the blink. Ah! The bonds in. Oh, sorry. Here. My thanks. What you doing outside? There you are. How's young Mary? Sleeping like a baby. My plan is to start a formal training this week. Oh, wow. I'll help you. Let it be nice. Something wrong? I decided to keep on living. Every time I see our students improve, I'm tortured by the fact that I can't do more to prepare them for the future. It would seem that you're still a workaholic. But <laughs> you defended us almost on your own for decades. So yeah, I'm sure it's hard to come down from that high. Yeah. That's a little harsh. But you are still able to help them. By being at their side, your presence is enough to inspire greatness. That's the truth. You should sit back and put your feet up. Don't apologize for being alive. Thanks. Uh, damn. I like that line. Don't apologize for being alive. I like that a lot. My, this is unusual. A pleasure to see you here, Doctor. Oh, God. He's still a doctor here? I oh. Hope research is proving fruitful. Yes. All that's left is to wait for the finishing touches. Oh, you still are a doctor here. I didn't realize that. Next day. We'll be here soon. Yeah, unfortunate. Ain't it? Damn. Oh, that's so scary. Like, ah! All the tree blossoms. Ugh. It's spring break, but we can't even enjoy it because our work studies are still going. It says we have an expeditionary operation. So like a work field trip? No, hold on, for real? That's weird. Same for us. Our agency oh. too. I wonder why. Where are we going? Oh, let's go. Cool. You ready to do your best in first grade? Who the fuck are you? There are heroes at the foot of the mountain. But we'll 
the evacuating residents from our position in the back. The League of Villains. No. The Paranormal Liberation Front was playing. And the harrowing incident that would shake superhuman society was about to begin. Wait, are we actually jumping right into this next season? Are we? Yo. Oh my God, that'd be intense if we're just jumping in. Oh. Without even seeing season six, I can already say, I am so excited for season six. Oh my God, it cannot come soon enough at this point. I know we have the movie, which is awesome, but oh, I'm just so, so excited already for season six because from what they're already showing us, at least some point in season six, we're going to start the paranormal liberation front fight. So I like, are we doing that like right away? Or are we just sending students here to like scout? What have you? I'm curious since they're all called there and they literally like, oh, we are doing this too during spring break, blah, blah, blah. It must be like right away. So that's wild. Um, but don't we still have like three, three, four months still? Something like that. So I think we have time. So I'm curious to see what happens because Deku still has a lot of other quirks to master. But I'm really excited that baby's gonna learn my baby, my Nana Shimuru. I'm so excited. Ah! Because that means that we're going to get to, like, talk to her a little bit when he gets to, like, you know, have that little moment in the, you know, power scape brain. Uh, he'll get to talk to her. I'm so excited because I love her. You guys just, ah, uh, uh, no one can understand my undying love for her. My, my buff mama, like, oh, and she floats like, ugh. Queen could literally sweep me off my feet. She's so amazing. She's so kind, so passionate, so beautiful, so sweet and caring. And it looked like she was as good as a mom as she could have been. Or I shouldn't say, uh, she did seem like a good mom, just left. And then her son resented her for leaving because she was a hero. So like she seemed like she, while alive, did the best she could. So I can respect that, you know, single mom life. She does her best. She got to go work. Got to put food on the table. So I am jazzed to see where season six is going to go. Um, I'm glad that we got to see the students a little bit at the end. It's nice just to kind of check in with them and see how they've all grown during their work studies so that we don't need to cover it when we start season six. I'm kind of glad that we just got to kind of wrap that up a bit. I know they're still doing it, but it's nice to just get that power growth kind of out of the way now versus at the start of season six. So really do appreciate that. Um, Along with all that though, I love the villain arc. It was, a, <laughs> I don't mean to make it sound bad, but it was, it was intense. It was a lot, which was good. It was good. Just intense. And then, um, the uh, 1A verse 1B was really fun. I feel like that's the last time we're going to have a not serious segment. I feel like we're going to be on a uh, intense clock for a while with the show that um, we'll have maybe endearing moments, but not moments that don't have stakes anymore. I feel like everything we do is going to matter and have some amount of stake to it. So... Yes, I can already see Jackie trying to learn float. It's going to be kind of funny, but I don't think everything we do now has that overall aura of like, this matters. So definitely excited. Uh, Poor Aerie, like I feel so bad for her. The second they said her name, I got like, oh, mama bear mode. I was like, what's wrong with my baby? But she's okay. It's just her quirk is kind of going off randomly and I feel bad for her. But I'm glad that Aizawa's going to start her training soon. That'll help. But it'll probably... She's probably going to feel uncomfortable and feel some pain and uncomfortability. Just because, like, they're going to try to start working on her using her quirk. 
which means activating it or trying to activate it, which isn't going to be great. But at least Aizawa's there to watch out for her. Like, literally, there's no better person for her to train with than Aizawa. Someone who can keep her quirk in check. So, really, really great, honestly. Um, I'm curious if we'll get to kind of see that training and if it will come into play. I'm also curious if Mirio will get his powers back before the the uh, <sighs> paranormal. I like saying league. I'm just going to say paranormal from now on, okay? Um, the uh, paranormal, or what is it? P P L P L F P L F. I don't like that either. If I just say league, just know what I'm talking about, okay? <laughs> um, but I want, I'm curious if Mirio will get his quirk back before we have to take on the paranormal group. Um, I'm not sure. I'm, like, crossing my fingers he will, but I have no idea. Because if we can't, if Aerie can't master her quirk, I don't really know how we're going to get back now. So, it's, it's intimidating. There's a lot of stakes going on with the show, and I like it. I like that these things are kind of adding up, and we're starting to get close to that boiling point where everything is going to have to come to a head, which is so cool. Um, I'm curious how long we'll have to wait to get season six. Um, just with the pandemic still kind of going on, things are just a little <sighs> still in the uh, animation industry. So I'm definitely curious. I would love if the show came back in like summer again for the summer season. But I I don't know if they could pump it out. I'm not entirely sure. Like I would assume they probably already started production for season six, but I don't know. Um I I don't mind waiting till like winter or even spring season of, uh, 2023. So like winter or 2020, yeah, 2023 winter. Isn't that how they go off of it? Or into 2023 spring season. I I'm willing to wait. I think they're going to try to work hard to get out sooner than that, but I don't mind waiting. Um, I am very excited for that season. So I would rather them take all the time they need than to stress themselves out, stress out the cast, stress out, um, the, whole team that's working on it, music, what have you, I'd rather they take their time and just um, make it awesome. Because this season, super awesome. Great. Flawless. I had such a fun time watching it. Um, and I appreciate all the work they did while still trying to keep everyone safe and healthy as well. Uh, deeply appreciate it. Along with the um, English dub cast too. They did great being able to stay... Um, at least two season, two seasons, two weeks uh, behind is amazing. I was fully ready and willing to wait out like a month, two months for uh, the English dub. So I'm very glad, even though I was already behind watching it anyways, um, I'm glad that they were able to get it done so fast while still keeping the whole team safe and healthy. So at the end of the day, that's all that really matters to me is making sure that everyone's safety comes first. So, and health. Safety and health. I should make sure that's stated. <laughs> so, overall, I really enjoyed this season. I thought it was great. There's a lot to look forward to. I definitely, if I had to rate this season compared to the others, I think maybe this might be my... Mm, might be tied for second favorite season. Like, I definitely put the season at, like, at least an eight. Because I enjoyed it. I thought it was cool. I thought the villain arc was awesome. And seeing Class 1A versus Class 1B was really fun. Uh, definitely cool to explore other quirks and get to see the other students. So, yeah, I'd say probably an eight for the, the whole season. So, I enjoyed eight out of ten, I should state. <laughs> So overall, I very much enjoyed this season. I hope you guys did as well. It was really fun and I'm going to miss my hero, but oh, I guess we'll have to watch Demon Slayer. <laughs> now I'm joking. I'm really excited for Demon Slayer. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching. It means so much to me. Please remember to like, share, subscribe, 
all that fun jazz, comment down below. Let me know what you guys think, and I'll see you all later. Bye!